Potential sequeltering news came down Monday night when Alabama announced that Colin Sexton, a former five-star recruit and a dazzling point guard who has a legitimate chance at being a top-10 pick in the 2018 NBA draft, is not currently eligible. The press release was sent shortly before the Crimson Tides exhibition versus Alabama Huntsville tipped the NCAA informed us late this afternoon that Colin Six Sexton has not had his eligibility reinstated by the NCAA, Alabama AD Greg Burns said in a statement. We don't have any further information at this time, but we will continue to cooperate with the NCAA and work toward a resolution that results in Colin Six timely reinstatement. While we are disappointed, the right decision was to err on the side of caution for tonight's exhibition game. The news comes four days before the start of the college basketball season. Alabama, a trendy pick to finish in the top four of the SEC and ranked 19th in the preseason top 25 and 1 at CBSSports.com opens versus Memphis in the Veterans Classic in Annapolis, Maryland. Expectations haven't been this high for the tight in years, but they will ebb if Sexton remains on the bench well into November and even December. It's key to note that Burns specifically referenced the NCAA not yet clearing Sexton. Alabama is one of the schools connected to the FBI investigation that has captured the curiosity of the sport. Four assistant coaches at Auburn, USC, Oklahoma State and Arizona face criminal charges stemming from the investigation. Alabama basketball staffer Kobe Baker resigned September 27 following an internal review by the athletic department. That review was prompted by the FBI's public reveal of its probe less than 36 hours prior. Our review has not identified any NCAA or SEC rules violations nor the involvement of any other coach or staff member, Burns said after Baker's resignation was announced. At that time, the Tuscaloosa News reported that Baker may have been involved in a scheme to accept money in return for directing a U player to sign with an Atlanta financial advisor after declaring for the NBA draft. The financial advisor Rashawn Michel, one of the ten men charged in the FBI's case. Michel is based out of Atlanta where Sexton is from. Per the FBI's findings, Baker accepted $5,000 from Michel after Baker allegedly arranged a meeting between Michel and the father of a highly regarded incoming freshman. Sexton is the only 2017 recruit from Georgia on Alabama's roster. It's unknown what specifically is keeping Sexton on the sidelines and how long he'll be forced to wait. Burns said Baker's dismissal did not come from an NCAA violation. If that's true, the NCAA has something on Sexton that, for now, could fall outside the realm of the FBI case but at this point a number of realities are possible.